Hi guys, back with another one, another quick tutorial. So you've created a new level, but you want the sky from Unreal, and you realize that it's not actually in your content browser. You don't know where it is. And if we search sky, we don't get anything. But this is pretty simple. All we've got to do is go to View Options, Show Engine Content, and down in here, we'll have access to the main engine files of what Unreal uses. And we know it was already in the scene because it was in the other level. So you can actually search, scroll down, and look for Engine Sky, and it'll be here. Or you can just simply type Sky into the search bar now and drag it into your scene. So cool. So we've now got a sky, but you'll see it's orange. And if we change anything, nothing really happens. But what we need to do is add our directional light actor to the blueprint. And you can see just by selecting it within the scene, if you don't have one, you can actually access it just from lights and then dragging a directional light into your scene. And now you can see that we have a directional light which controls our sky. So if we select our light and let's say we change the angle of it and put it upside down, then if we select our sky in the editor or in the world outliner, we can actually hit refresh material and that allows us to change the time of day within our scene. And we can actually get a bit more out of this by using, uh, where is it? So we can actually get a bit more out of this by using our skylight. Now if we add this into the scene, you can see the shadows are much uh, are less harsh and it's not black anymore. So we can actually use this to determine how our shadows and lighting is built. I'd have to do a build, but I set this to movable. There. Cool. Now, if we refresh the material, you'll see we've actually got a sky where the time of day that we can actually change. So that's it for this one. I hope it, I hope it was pretty good. Hope it could help some out. Um, if you haven't already heard, we've got a Discord channel now, and it's filling up pretty fast with some awesome stuff. Uh, we've got I highly recommend checking out the work in progress, so we see who from the community, what people from the community are working on, and what they're up to, and also just get some help in general with stuff if you need it. If you're new here, I highly recommend subscribing and possibly leaving a like. If you have any questions that you want to see answered or there's something you want to know about Unreal, either drop it in the Discord or in the comment section below, and we'll get onto it. Awesome. Have a good one, guys. Bye.